Adding email accounts in Eudora. This tutorial will show you how to configure an account in Eudora to check. Before we configure the account in Eudora, let's address an issue with sending email that will require us to make a slight modification to our installation of the application. The default port for the Simple Mail Transfer Protocol, or SMTP, is port 25. Many Internet service providers block this port at their network firewall. This is done as a security measure to prevent viruses like email worms and spam zombies from sending email from infected machines connecting to their network. For this reason, our server is running a second copy of the SMTP service that is listening for connections on port 26 as well, and we will be changing our outgoing port to use this one in order to connect to our server. Eudora comes with an add-on that allows specifying a different port for outgoing email. This add-on is not enabled by default during the installation of Eudora. We will need to enable this add-on in order to change the port used to connect to our outgoing mail server. To enable this add-on, we will close Eudora and then restart it after making the necessary changes. Click the Close button. Open the directory where Eudora is installed on your system. Double-click the Extra Stuff folder. Right-click the esoteric.epi file. Select Copy. Click the Up button. Click the Edit menu. Select Paste. Next, we will restart Eudora and continue with adding the account settings. Click the Tools menu. Select Options. Enter your real name. Enter your email address. Enter the mail server incoming name. This is typically mail.domain.tld. Enter the username. Typically, this is the same as your email address. Enter the SMTP server outgoing name. Typically, this is the same as the mail server incoming name. Click the incoming mail icon. Click either the POP3 radio button or the IMAP radio button. Servers are often configured to support both the Post Office Protocol version 3 or POP3 and the Internet Message Access Protocol or IMAP. POP3 accounts will download all of the email that is in the inbox for the account on the server to the local machine, and the client will read the local copy when displaying a message. Typically, the messages are deleted from the server when they're finished downloading to the client. 
IMAP account will download just the headers when checking email and then download the individual messages as they are read. IMAP accounts will generally also delete the copy on the server when the local copy is deleted. Checking this checkbox will tell Eudora not to request that the server delete its copy of the messages once they're downloaded. This is useful when it is necessary to check the email from clients configured on multiple systems. However, it is recommended that messages on the server be removed manually through webmail periodically if this is enabled to avoid reaching the mailbox quota for the account on the server. Next, let's change the port for outgoing mail. Click the Ports icon. Enter the SMTP port. Click the OK button. Congratulations! You now know how to configure an account in Eudora to check email.